South Korea is cracking down on colored plastic bottles and certain kinds of packaging that are hard to recycle because they contain PVC. Our Kim Jae-hee has this report. On Wednesday, South Korea's Ministry of Environment enacted new regulations on plastic to boost resource circulation and help protect the environment. The revision of the Resource Recycling Act bans the manufacture and use of colored plastic bottles for beverages because transparent plastic bottles are easier to shred and more easily recycled. Those already stocked in stores can be sold, but no more after that. PVC packaging, which is commonly used to wrap food and household products, is also banned in the same way. Plastic bottles will also be rated on a four-grade scale depending on their recyclability, and companies will be taxed more depending on how difficult their products are to recycle under the new grading system. The worst offenders will also be liable for an environmental fine. Local consumers were both surprised and amused to see the familiar green soju bottles swapped out for transparent ones. It's different from the original soju. It looks like bottled water now. I prefer the green ones. I was surprised to see the sudden color change, but it looks clean and I like it. Lotte Chilsung Cider has also swapped its green bottles to colorless ones. It's the first change in 35 years since the drink's launch in 1984. However, some products like medicines and certain foods require color packaging to keep them from deteriorating. Beer, for example, is exempt from the new rules, but the government says it plans to find an alternative option for beer within the next five years. Kim Jae-hee, Arirang News.